How's it going everybody? Sean Allen here. Another day, another vlog. Yes, I am actually back out here in the garden. No, this is not going to be a gardening video for today. Tomorrow's vlog will be. But I thought I'd give you a little updates to what's going on currently with the gardening that's been going on recently. Now, for those of you who've been watching my vlogs, you guys know that I've been doing a lot of stuff around here. First and foremost, you guys saw me take out the Cape Honeysuckle and install this new archway. This was a pain in the you know where to pull out. But yes, this is complete. We still have yet to plant the grapevines here, but that will be coming soon. And I'm hoping to have that on video soon. But we are planting new stuff here. This is a raised bed that my dad built. These are Persian cucumbers. We planted those last night, actually. And I believe it was last night. Yeah, it was last night. And this is going to produce a lot of really interesting little cucumbers. Now, in case you don't know what Persian cucumbers are, they're like maybe a third the size of normal cucumbers. They're literally just cucumbers you can pick and just eat right off the bat like that. They're really good. Then over here on this side, we have another raised bed. We don't really know exactly what we're going to be planting over here. But at some point, we will determine what we're going to be doing with this one. But as you can see, we actually got this area cleared out. A lot of junk was removed from this area. You can see this is actually a piece of the original, I think this is the original grapevine that was here before. And we also have bougainvillea as well as a privet tree in here. We might be removing the privet tree, not, not like soon or anything, but that will be coming soon at some point in the future. And uh, we're trying to determine if we're going to be putting beets or lettuce in here, so we'll let you guys know what's going on later on. As you can see, this is our gardening cart. Yes, it looks amazing that I cleaned it off. This is actually a piece of roots that I pulled out of the ground <laughs> that I decided to leave on here. It's kind of like a mini, mini decoration. Yeah, I know. I'm weird. But we do have some new stuff we're going to be planting. Look at this. We have potato seeds in here. We got other stuff. We got lettuce seeds. There's also beans. I saw beans flying around here somewhere. Over here we've got Red Beauty. That's a pepper. Also Better Bell. And then this might be a yellow one. Yes. This is a Golden California Wonder. Going into the big garden section here, we have new tomato plants that we just planted right in here. A different assortment of tomatoes. We have Early Girl and oh, I, I can't name them all. Sorry. But we have just a bunch of tomato plants. We're still trying to get rid of some of these weeds in here that are just growing around the garden, but slowly but surely they are being removed. We also have these onion plants. We got tomatoes as well as beets and potatoes. So yeah, we've got a lot of good stuff here. And last but certainly not least, this is where we had a lot of ivy growing along the side of our house. And I removed all that because this is also be a gardening section. We're still trying to determine what we're gonna be putting in here, but things are looking good so far. Yes, I do know there are some areas where we have a little bit of patchwork to deal with. That wasn't from me, that's old. So, we'll be patching those up at some point. Oh, there's a spider. There's a spider. Hi, Spidey. Hey, Spidey cat. Here is our redwood tree that I got from Disney California Adventure a few years ago. It's looking mighty nice. Look at that. <laughs> that's so cool. Okay, so now that I've given you guys all the updates of what's going on with the garden, there's going to be a future project I'm probably going to be starting tomorrow for tomorrow's vlog, and it's going to be a big one. I've never done anything like this big ever. I mean, you guys have seen me remove stuff from the garden and planting different things and all that, but this is going to be unlike anything I've ever done, okay? So... What is it going to be? I'm going to tell you guys right now. So as you can see along the back here, we have all these pots and things here. We also have a few hibiscus bushes and a rose plant right over there. And we also have this red windmill right there. So what's going to be happening? Well, you may notice we have these stakes in the ground right here. As you can see, well, guess what, guys? What we're planning on doing is the following. We're going to be planting not one, but two different fruit trees here. That's right. Two different fruit trees in this section right here. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, Sean, that's going to be a lot of plants to be removing from this section. Are we really going to be removing all of these, like trash and all this? No. The hibiscus plants are going to stay where they are. I think one of them is going to have to be moved to a different location. But 
the pots here, they could be moved no matter what. The windmill will stay. But basically what we're doing is we're going to be extending, you can probably see it, it's this boundary here of the bricks further out so we can plant the trees. This will all be somewhat moved. I, I put air quotations because we might be putting these back in its place. There are going to be two different fruit trees here planted in this section. We haven't decided which ones yet, but trust me when I say this, it's going to look good. Now these trees, they're not big yet, but they're going to be getting big, okay? So we're going to be determining that later on, probably tomorrow, what they're going to be. So we got some big stuff coming your way, guys. Oh my goodness, I can't believe how many things I've done out there. You know, just all the gardening work. And I know that for some of you who are thinking, oh my gosh, that place looks so overrun. Listen, <laughs> there's only so many days that I'm able to do stuff outside. We all pitch in, the whole family does. And we might overlook something and stuff gets started and then we forget about it later on. It's, it happens. It happens all the time. And I'm sure it's happened to a lot of you guys too, right? So... Don't completely bash me on that, okay? <laughs> but yes, things are getting done finally now that we have all this time to be able to do that sort of thing. I think that's kind of a, a positive from this whole thing that's been going on worldwide because now we have this time, like free time, in order to be able to do that sort of thing. I'm hoping that these videos can also challenge you guys because, yes, I know that I have all these things here at the house, but that doesn't mean you guys can't also do it as well. Like, you can also plant a garden. Like, if you're living in an apartment building, I know that in some cases, maybe you don't have a patio or whatever, but you can still do stuff like, you can grow like a small plant, like a tomato plant. They do have these things like seen on TV things where you can buy like these ready, like ready to make or whatever uh, planting kits that you can grow like tomatoes and carrots and whatever. And you can also have an herb garden. I've seen that in some places. If you have a patio, you can also grow a small garden if they allow that. You can also do things like changing your eating habits, like going healthy. You can either go organic. Well, in, in case of today, I'm not sure if being organic is the best option because a lot of the options are gone. But, you know, you can find ways to better improve yourself during this time. I wouldn't say this is an official restart for your life, but it's definitely a temporary one because what's going on right now with everything being closed and all, your options are kind of limited. And I just hope that, you know, during this time, you are able to do some of the things that you've always wanted to do. Like maybe you wanted to draw, maybe you wanted to try and do some music or whatever. So this is your opportunity now to do this stuff. And when things open up, yes, going back to the normal routine, it's going to be a little hard. But during this time, you could actually do that, use that free time in order to do the things that you've always wanted to do, right? And so that's basically what I'm doing right now. So anyways, you guys, that's going to be it for this vlog. Just a little update of what's going on with the garden tomorrow. That's going to be the one that I think is going to be a big one. Redoing that whole section of the backyard. It's going to be a big task. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching in the scenes. I say in Hollywood, I'm not at home. Wait, I am at home. <laughs> that, my friends, is a wrap. Be sure to follow me on Instagram. Be sure to also check out my other channels, the educational series, the Disneyland video series, and the Travel Town series. That's it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.